Hey everyone, here's another video about that jerk who beat me up. Hi. So what should I say, ma? You explained what happened last night and everything? Yeah, but really quietly. You want to explain that again so that they can hear you better? I was removing laundry, trying to be nice to the person before me. Cause I thought theirs was done, didn't know so it wasn't. Cause I thought it was cold and not wet. Then the jerk, that's my nickname for him, came in and started getting after me for moving his clothes. And I said, excuse me, so I could put my stuff in the dryer. Then he started yelling at me and calling me names after cornering me. And he promised that he would go away if I hit him. So I did. Because I take things literally. And I trust people. Then he punched me with his fist that he has a V-shaped ring on and busted my lip open. And blood went everywhere. What happened after that? Cherry came. Oh, manager came. And got him away from me. And then told me to come to the front office because he's not there. But she didn't know where he went. So they're still looking for him. Okay. And I got down there. She called me down. And she had already called the cops to make the report. Which we did. And are you pressing us, uh, charges for on him for assault? I am. And what could also be a hate crime? Because he kept calling you... The R word. The R word, which we don't want to say because we don't even like that word. And he called me a fat asshole. It's ridiculous. And then we had to... Uh, he called me fatty also. The emergency people came out. You're, you're none of those. You already know that, though, right? Yeah. Okay. The emergency people came out, and we decided that you needed to go up to the ER to make sure how everything was. And what did we find out of the ER? I had to get four stitches. Yes. And yeah. a concussion. Yeah, close. He caused a closed head injury and a laceration in your lip. And, in fact, and a small cut on my lower lip. Yeah. A superficial uh, laceration on the inside it's super. of your lip. Um, <laughs> and they also did x rays, but thankfully, nothing else, you know, nothing was broken. They didn't or get the ones back from my mouth yet. No. Maybe it takes another uh, kind of person to look at them or something that wasn't, didn't look at them yet. I'm not sure. So you had to get four stitches in your mouth. In, in your in your upper lip, I should say, not in your mouth. That sounds totally different. Looks like this. But you are right. Yes, there was blood everywhere in the washing machine, the floor, dryer, and the dryer all over you. I mean, and and all simply because you removed some clothes by accident. I mean, well, I was trying to be nice. It's. Absolutely ridiculous. I mean, I didn't notice his were still wet. I thought they were just cold. But it's okay, even though you know, that's a teeny tiny mistake. It does not warrant anyone to back you into a corner that you can't get out of and keep threatening you. Okay, that nobody has any right to do that. Threatening you, calling you names, bullying you. They don't have any reason to do that to you. That is assault, plain and simple, okay? What he did was wrong. Right? And then, near the end of the, uh, the situation of what I saw what was going on, he took his belt off. I don't know what he thought he was going to be doing after that, before the uh, manager stepped in and stopped the situation. But He, he probably was going to try hitting me with it. I don't know, but thankfully she stepped in and did stop it. Oh, and um, he tried to tell her that he never hit me. Yeah, but it's all on video. 
He did it, like, literally right in front of the camera, so you cannot... You know. That's why I backed up there, because I knew there was a camera there. So if anything happened, it would be on camera. Like, the imprint of his ring was... The image of his ring was right in Yuki's lip. So it's like and it was nice. a slight one on my cheek. Oh, yeah. You had a mark up there on your... On his... The right cheek, right up here. Not this. Oh, this, you could see it. This is from our kitty from years ago. You His, could see it. Yeah, you know, our cat at that time decided it was nice to walk over right people's there, right? sleeping faces. Right there? Yeah. You could see it. So, unfortunately, that was Yuki's Friday night because you know, he doesn't have I that. I guess that's my FU Friday. Pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> but I've got a very strong Yuki, and we'll, you'll make your way through this. And we'll Wait, press that was charges. Saturday. That was Saturday. That was Yuki Saturday night. You know what? I was up a little bit ago. We were up all night because of it, so don't mind me. I definitely charges know what day of the week it is. For assault, harassment, and hate crime. That's correct. Because he could see, he saw that I had a walker, so he knew I had disabilities. You had your cane with you, not your walker. Cane. But still, regardless, you had, you know. So you could see I had stuff. I have disabilities. It's almost the same thing. Well, I know. I'm just, <laughs> just being technical. Right here is numb. Oh, and on top of that, Yuki uh, talked about this online and had somebody tell them, and I don't care if this person sees this because it's my opinion too, that we should forgive the guy because he obviously has a mental illness. Um, no. You know, I, I have anxiety. I have depression. I've had, you know, stuff happen to me in the past. I don't go out rage attacking people. Okay. Yeah. As you guys have watched Yuki's videos, you know Yuki has been, uh, I hate calling them mental illnesses, but anxiety, depression, schizoaffective disorder, um, Tourette's, and Tourette's, ADHD, ADHD autism. autism. Yuki doesn't go out rage attacking people. We're not going to say, oh, it's okay that you punched my kid in the face and caused the cousin had have to get four stitches and now his PNES will probably be worse because that stuff all of this stuff triggers what Yuki has and just I've been makes it all worse since it so, happened I've been having more of the sleepy spells exactly what I, where I, what I mean and even if he you know, and it, they've been lasting longer too happened when I was on the toilet and I woke up after like 20 minutes <sighs> so I think that one I actually blacked out Mm. Until Chrissy asked me if I was okay before she left. That woke me up. It's not okay to forgive someone just because they might have a mental illness. It does not give them the rights to attack other people. Oh, and I have a loose tooth. Oh, well, yeah, I forgot about that. Your tooth being loose. This one. That's, you, you know. said not to mess with it. I did. That's the same thing as when they try to use, like, oh, the person had Asperger's or autism, and they, it's a, it, it, it was a dish that fell. Sorry, Yuki. You, you okay? It scared me. It was just bad timing. Um, that when they, they use that excuse, the excuse of their autism, and say, that's why they shot a, a shot and killed people. No, I don't, no, you can't use their autism and stuff as an excuse for that. That's not, no. That's not what and makes just, people do that. And just like the article that I read before where they try to use his autism as an excuse for him trying to strangle another kid at school. So I, I cannot say, yes, that's okay that this guy attacked my do my child because he has, partly has a mental illness. That's not okay. That doesn't make it okay for you to attack other people. It doesn't make it excusable, so... You can't just go around, attack people, and say, Oh, it's okay. I'm sorry. I had this. No. It's not okay. So we will be, you know, 
pressing charges as much as we can. So, hopefully, the what person that makes sure they're in jail and stuff. The prosecuting attorney. Well, hopefully, the prosecutor attorney does something this time. Yeah. And does it right. Since the sexual assault jerk is still out on the loose. I agree. Out on the loose. That's a problem, too. Yeah? No. That's one of the dangers of living where we have to live right now. You don't know what you're out here living with, unfortunately. Yeah, I thought he left his stuff in there and it just got cold. I understand. So I was trying to take it out so it could get warmer. You did not do anything wrong, Yuki. I know. Even if you did... I was just explaining why I took it out. Even if you did take his laundry out, that does not promote somebody to rage attack you. I'm sorry. I it know. doesn't. Nothing makes that okay. I don't like people seeing my lip, though. It's okay. You're beautiful no matter what, okay? Handsome, no matter what. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Okay. Bye, everyone. Oh yeah. Bye. I did. <laughs>